A new survey of consumers and human resource managers finds that issues like harassment and equal pay for women in the workplace should be a priority for businesses. And joining us this morning to share insights on the survey are two top experts on business ethics. We have Jane Randall, uh, co-CEO of Social Impact Consultancy for Carp Randall and co-founder of No More. And joining her is Catherine Hernandez-Blades, the Chief Brand and Communications Officer at Affleck, a company which has been awarded top honors for their ethics. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Good morning. So Catherine, let's start with you. Tell me about this survey, and man, oh man, is this a timely survey, I would say. Absolutely, Carly. It's one of the reasons we did it. We've actually conducted a corporate social responsibility survey every year for the past four years. We pivot the focus just a little bit each year, and because of the times we're in now with the Me Too movement and everything going on, we thought it would be important to take a look at how corporations are handling sexual harassment issues in the workplace, and the results were incredible. Now this is interesting. Do you think the Me Too movement had any effect on how people are actually answering the survey? My assumption is maybe they're a little bit more truthful. Well, I can't speak to that, but I can tell you what we learned was very enlightening. So let's start with the thing that surprised me the most, and it had to do with parity at pay, in terms of pay between the genders. Now, we're very fortunate at Aflac. We've re worked very hard at it. So we are actually at parity. However, it's a huge opportunity for corporate America because most companies are not. The other interesting finding, Carly, had to do with the fact that while human resources professionals think they're doing a great job, as a matter of fact, 90% of them think they're doing a wonderful job communicating their sexual harassment policies to their employees, 55% of employees didn't even know their companies had sexual harassment policies. Oh, wow. So again, huge opportunity, yes. Jane, what surprised you most about this survey and why do you think this is uh, uh, such an important to, time to talk about this? Well, I think certainly driving awareness around these issues is super important and this has really helped with the survey. And looking at what, I think what really struck me was what employers think they're doing and telling their employees and what employees really are understanding and getting. And there's a huge disconnect there. And again, as Catherine said, it's a great opportunity. You have um, in your employee base, whether you're a big company or a small company, you have your greatest um, set of ambassadors. They're the ones that you know will go out and, and rah-rah for you. And so it's really important to, that they know what's happening inside the company and outside the company. And sometimes companies are so focused on you know communicating outside about their good works, they forget that this audience is inside. And that's actually something they, that Affleck does really, really well. So what do companies do when they get information like this? What is the next step? And then how do you you know, expand that to other companies and get the conversation going there as well. Well, I think first of all, you have to be authentic and you have to be very honest with yourself. Companies should take a good hard look at their own data and their own numbers and figure out where their own opportunities are for improvement and then look to other companies who do it well for best practices so that they can model those practices. Very important. All right. Well, where can people go to get more information to maybe join in on this conversation? Maybe they're an employee and says, wait a minute, I want our employer to kind of look at this more closely. What would you have them do? I would have them visit aflac.com forward slash ACSR and look at the survey results. And for more information on Jane's organization, No More, please visit nomore.org. Easy enough. We'll make sure and put that info on our website as well. Ladies, thank you so much. We Great. appreciate your time this morning. Thank Thanks, you. Carly. All right, coming up 